Good afternoon, sports fans. My name is Magnitude. Welcome back to Mag Nation Green, episode 121, the beginning. Today we have a women's fatal four-way match. Uh, there is some, uh, I'm going to say there is some murkiness in the women's title, or the Supernova title picture, as we have Hawk Girl being the current champion, the current Supernova champion, but uh, after the events of the uh, Winter Women's Classic, we have a couple people who have uh, kind of staked claim to that title belt. That person being Tracer, one of them, who uh, Tracer, who was the uh, person who pinned Hawkgirl in that tournament. And then we have Psylocke, the winner of the whole damn thing. Both of them think, you know what, they have uh, an actual claim to that tournament. So there's going to be some uh, some fun with that going forward. Uh, and it's going to end up turning into, uh, you know, there's going to end up being uh, probably some, uh, some I would say it's going to end up turning into be kind of a, a convoluted mess. So we have to try to find some more clear-cut uh, uh, contenders to make it even more com convoluted. So we have a uh, women's fatal four-way match. If you guys enjoy the videos and you want to try support, please leave a like on the videos. A like to help the channel grow. And honestly, the channel is growing subscriber-wise. So thank you all for that if you're new subscribers. Uh, I love comments below. If you want to become a Patreon like our man Mr. Brazzle Dazzle and, of course, Survivor, you can uh, do so and become direct contributors and direct... Um, well, that's it, really. Direct contributors is the, is the right one. Direct contributors to the channel. And uh, so today is Diva versus Captain Marvel versus, uh, that is Sailor Moon versus Wonder Woman. And the winner of this match will uh, have a staked claim as a contender for the uh, women's, for the Supernova title, whether it be in a. Uh, so, whatever the match ends up being, it ends up being a triple threat match. Um, then, and then this person is the fourth contender making it a fit of four. If it's a one-on-one -on -one match, the winner of this match makes it a triple threat match being the third contender. So there is some stake in this match. However, they do not know what the event, what the outcome will be, or what even kind of match they will be participating in. So uh, there's a lot of uncertainty right now surrounding this match and starting kind of this title picture as a whole. So I'm, I'm excited to see where it goes as it as it happens. Like I said, we had Psylocke who won the Winter Women's Classic, who has staked her claim uh, for this title. Then we have uh, Tracer, uh, who def you know was one that pinned Hawk Girl in the tournament. That was in a non-title match, but uh, pinned her there, and well, she also feels like she has some uh, some say in the title. This is now Wonder Woman entering in a trench coat. I'm not quite sure why that's happening. It just is. So we have to accept some things the way they are. Here is Wonder Woman. It's a first uh, first fall or one fall match, so and, and no disqualifications and no rope breaks, all that great stuff. First woman to score a pinfall or submission on another woman will be the winner and will be a contender, uh, whether it's number one uh, or number one A, number one B, or number one C. So there's a lot of like I said, a lot of uncertainty, and uh, frankly, I'm excited to see where kind of this title picture goes going forward, as there's a lot that can happen, a lot that can change. And now the final entrant of this match is going to be Sailor. That is a creepy as shit face. Holy goddamn! Looks like Sailor Moon did meth for 25 years. I can't even complain, though. I do. I mean, I don't make any of the cause, so everyone else does, and, uh, you know, I just kind of give people shit all that. There are some, uh, I, I, oh, full disclosure, I would do way worse. So, leave it for what it is. I would do way worse, and that is creepy. There is Sailor Moon, and she will be the fourth woman in this match. So we have some high profile, you know, currently we have, uh, you know, uh, Wonder Woman and Captain Marvel currently uh, right smack dab in the middle of, the, of this, uh, this, our cinema minds. Uh, Diva from Overwatch, of course, Sailor Moon making a comeback because, well, it's, I mean, at least in my brain she is. Either way, four women. They're right there. <laughs> the bell has rung the match because we are now underway. What a clothesline by Wonder Woman. The uh, neck breaker by Sailor Moon. Now Wonder Woman elbowing Diva who says, nah. Wonder Woman out throwing Diva over the ropes. What a punch by Diva. And there goes Wonder Woman. Sailor Moon now and Captain Marvel working on each other in the ring. Captain Marvel lifting Sailor Moon. Sailor Moon countering to a DDT. What? It's like an impaler DDT. Marvel on the, on the apron and she counters Sailor Moon's punch. Hops back in the ring. Sailor Moon, uh-oh, Wonder, no, that is going to be, oh, a Gagori bomb? Or is she going to hold the submission? She's going to hold the, oh my goodness, what a maneuver by Captain Marvel. Hooking the leg early now into Sailor Moon, but just a one count, that's, the, that's not going to work out that way. So yeah, still, they've paired off still. 
Wonder Woman taking out Diva on the outside of the ring there. It's still Sailor Moon. It is still Sailor Moon and... Oh, Captain Marvel. In the, and now uh, Wonder Woman going to go ahead and... Oh, she can get, get back in the ring now. And, oh, and then Wonder Woman is immediately escorted outside the ring. Escorted by one, of course. Sailor Moon lifted. Oh, going for a Hurricane Rana. Oh, Diva with a little Hurricane Rana there. It is now Wonder Woman on the outside. Diva and Sailor Moon were going after Captain Marvel, but then their alliance is broken. Oh, what a kick by Sailor Moon! There goes, there goes Captain Marvel. Neckbreaker trying to get broken up there by Diva, but unfortunately her dropkick falls just short. Ju oh, jumping arm breaker by Diva. Captain Marvel's gonna go ahead and get up. Sailor Moon on the outside, Captain Marvel to her feet. Captain Marvel in the middle right now of the strikes by both Diva and Wonder Woman. All four in the ring now once again. Captain Marvel. Oh, a little inside cradle there. Roll up by Diva. One. Trying to steal one. Cannot do so. Captain Marvel lifting Diva. Diva with a counter into a hurricane run. Oh, look at Frankensteiner. Into a, into a pinfall, but it's broken up there. And Sailor Moon went after Diva, and then uh, Wonder Woman did the same thing. There goes Sailor Moon to the outside, of the apron. Punch to the outside now by Diva. Diva following is now Wonder Woman and Captain Marvel. A dream match for some. What strength by Captain Marvel. And Wonder Woman just rolling around. Wonder Woman throwing. They're being thrown in the corner by Captain Marvel. What an uppercut. Oh, uppercuts. A series of uppercuts. Wonder Woman into the corner. Captain Marvel, more uppercuts. Oh, she has taken, taken a liking to the style of it, of Mr. Antonio Cesaro. I knew she was such a Cesaro fan. I mean, I guess, I mean, he is like the pin. Oh my goodness, what a punch. He looked like the pinnacle wrestling talent, so. A submission applied by Sailor Moon. Wonder Woman drop kicking the ref instead. Captain Marvel will bring the pin while Wonder Woman drop kicked the ref. There's Captain Marvel. Kicks by Wonder Woman now as the ref is still down. Sailor Moon, what a head scissors there. As Diva tried to intervene, but really just couldn't. Oh, Diva, electric chair drop to Sailor Moon. This has been a lot of carnage quickly. Sailor Moon going to the top rope, but, but Captain Marvel right there to punch her right off. Take down by Captain Marvel, what a punch. Right to the jaw, hooking the leg of Diva, trying to end it right here, trying to win it right now. She does! Captain Marvel advancing with the haymaker to end all haymakers. I, I, that was just brutal. Absolutely vicious on the part of Captain Marvel. That punch that she landed was... Wow, it was it was a brutal, brutal blow. In the end, it's, uh, it's Captain Marvel. I mean, that match wasn't the longest match, but it was, it was like a train wreck. There was a lot that happened in a very short amount of time. That match was like a it was like a train wreck. It was. It really was. And in the end, Captain Marvel will be the one who's moving on to uh, become the contender again, whether it's one A, one B, or one C in this uh, Supernova title picture. And she does so with a debilitating, debilitating strike to the jaw. So if you guys enjoyed these videos and you'd like to show your support. Uh, please do so by leaving a like. The likes are going to help the channel grow. Be sure to follow us on Facebook or Twitter. And uh, if you, check us out the website below at magnation.com. The website is uh, probably the number one reference as far as magnation things go. So again, if you guys enjoyed, uh, leave a like, uh, subscribe for more, and I will see each and every one of you guys next time.